guys, welcome back to another video, and in today's video we're talking about Carlos Condon versus Martin Kamen. So far the fights have been pretty, pretty good. That's for damn sure. I just love getting more free fights, and a lot of people are complaining. There's too many free fights on TV. There's too many fights nowadays. Well, it is true. I love those days when there was only a few fights here and there. Not like every freaking week there's a fight. I love MMA. I love the fighting game. But do you guys think there is a point where there's too much MMA? I kind of think there is. You guys might be saying, dude, having MMA all the time is pretty damn good. Yeah, it's good. But t this week we had a we had a, a fight Wednesday. We're going to have a fight Saturday. And we had a fight last Saturday. So to be honest, that's why some of these cards actually suck because they just have to throw so many people into these cards. Martin Cameron fighting Carlos Condon and I think this fight was round one was Martin Campman and round two and three went to Carlos that would be what I would be scoring the card at but it was a hell of a fight back and forth but I think the takedowns were was what was winning Martin Campman because he kept getting those uh great takedowns but Carlos Condon after the fight didn't even look winded I, I stated this before that Carlos Condon is still one of the top pound for pound fighters at 170. I would still put him up there as top three, top uh, four. I still think he deserves a title shot. I think he needs to fight one or two more guys and get another victory. But I think he's still in the hunt for a title shot. Let me know what you guys think of uh, this uh, card. To me, it was a decent uh, card. I love the main event. That's the main reason why I watched it. Donald Cerrone, that fight was okay. And what's next for Carlos Condon? I think Carlos Condon should fight, he should fight Roy McDonald. Roy McDonald should fight Carlos Condon. That should be the fight that should happen next for both these fighters. I think nowadays Carlos Condon can hang and bang with Roy McDonald. Even though Roy McDonald won that, basically beat the shit out of him in that first fight. But Carlos won that fight. But my honest opinion is they should rematch and I think Carlos can win that fight. I think Carlos can win GSP and beat GSP as long as he just doesn't get Russell to the ground. That's his main uh, problem is when he gets Russell to the ground, it's hard for him to get back to his feet because he's a, he's a uh, primarily a strike. And with this card, I'm going to say remember to rate, even if you hate, comment, subscribe, and let me know in the comment section below what you guys like about it and what you guys didn't like about it. What do you guys think is next for uh, Martin Catman and what do you guys think is next for Carlos Condon? Like I said, Carlos Condon I think should be fighting against... Rory McDonald, that's the fight I would want to see. But for Martin Kamen, I really don't know who he should be fighting. So I'll definitely see you guys in the next video.